Okay, so we're back for part two of the taco omelets. So, um, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for coming. I appreciate all of you. I appreciate all your kind words and, and everything. And meeting new friends, is it's amazing. It really is. So, I'm going to make a taco omelet and I'm going to put some spinach in the egg, with, in with the eggs. So, we need to chop up some spinach first. And then we need some eggs. I love putting spinach in our omelets. It's a little wet, but it, it will be fine. I think I need to get a paper towel in there though. It does seem a little wet. And I'm not gonna take all of the stems off, but I'm gonna take some of the stems off. Maybe I'll take all of the stems off, I don't know. I don't really like the stems per se. That one's bad. Put this garbage can over here with me. And then I just roll it up, chop it once. You don't want to chop it more than once. If you chop it more than once, you're going to lose flavor onto your board. And when you have green smear stuff on your board, that's flavor. You've, you've uh, chopped it away. So you don't want to do that. So you just want to chop once. So see how I'm, I'm ripping this off? Because I only want to chop once, right? So I'm going to get it all set up. And then I'm going to do a one chop. And one and done. That's it. One and done. Okay. Now what I like to do here is take a big one, right? I'm going to do a couple of them. And we're going to set leaves on top like this. On top of the big ones. And we're going to put smaller leaves on top. And then when I feel like it's enough leaves, I'm going to roll it as tight as I can. Just give it a little roll like that, right? Chop it this way. And then you get those little pieces. You only have to do one pass. You can do a second pass if you want to. That's up to you. But see the green there? I already chopped it too much. So I'm going to do another one. I just think like if you over fill, fill it. You know, because I have that big one on the bottom, and I'm rolling the little ones in there. And then this this cut is probably what's losing me the flavor of that cut right there. But I, I like it chopped up fine, finely chopped, and I'll chop it more than once. But I know what I'm doing. I know that I'm losing flavor. <laughs> so if I choose to lose flavor, like, I feel like I want to chop it again, but that's actually pretty good, right? So we're going to, we need enough for two omelets. So that's not quite there yet. So we're going to do one more. Find a big leaf. See if you can find a big leaf. This is pretty big. I suppose I could put a couple of big ones together. I don't want that stem, though. This one's good. I'll take that one. And a couple of these little ones. That looks like it's going to be good enough. Roll it up. And this one here, you don't have to do this one. This is only me. So, and then one chop, one and done. We'll do it one and done. Just want to get really small in there. There we are. And now that should be enough for two omelets. You don't want to do too much, right? You want, to, But you want to do enough. Okay, so that looks like good for two omelets. It's a tiny homestead here. It's just the two of us and our dog. <laughs> our dog is 11. He is a Lhasa Apso Maltese. So he's half Lhasa Apso and he's half Maltese. And I owned his aunt, which was full Lhasa Apso. Curtis and I were talking about that. Um, just yesterday, how much we miss her. I'm kind of nervous, so give me the lamb too. 
because Sophie didn't like guys. Not at all. He, she did not like men. Well, come to find out, it wasn't that she didn't like men. She didn't like men with hats on. So, we figured that out with my husband taking his, doing his hat on and off and on and off. And he finally, she finally warmed up to him because he would take his hat off when, when addressing her. And then she loved him. Oh my God, she loved him so much. So much. He, she slept with him, she laid with him, she played with him, she walked with him. She did everything with him, but didn't like any other guys because of the hats. It was the hats. It wasn't that they were guys. It was that they were wearing hats. Uh -huh. this, full, this drawer is big today. So here's my thought on this one. That drawer is wider than this one. So I put the foil and the parchment and all this here and then put all of this down there and then I'll have more room for this stuff and that stuff will fit. Then all the other stuff is crap and I don't need it in the drawer. And I don't need it, but I can't. I'm, I'm, I'm too busy right now. I'm too busy. I'm just too busy right now to deal with that. Oh, maybe I should plug in my phone. <laughs> Before I die, before my phone dies. Oh darn, it's not fitting right now. Oh dear, why not? Okay, what's happening? What, why is it not fitting? It was fitting earlier today. Okay, so I'm gonna scooch it this way. There we go. Oh, I'm still at 50%, oh, awesome. Okay, so that's good, yeah? Yeah, is that angle good? I think that's a good angle, to be honest with you. It's the first of that angle, but I think it's a good angle. Oh, yeah, that's better. Hey, 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 look at that. All right. Um, yeah, I kind of need that light on, though, to cook. I can't see my oven. <laughs> I can't see my stove. All right. So we are going to go ahead and use some of the uh, infused oil in our making of our omelets. So we're going to put a little oil in the pan. And we are also going to be putting some butter in the pan. Butter. Everything's better with butter. Yes. Okay. Oh, we have to grate some cheese before we put them eggs in there. I'm not even going to turn it on right now. So we're not there yet. We need to grate some cheese. Move my garbage can. Oops. Ow. Oh, gosh darn it. Mm. Okay. So I'm used to having a moon shape handle where it, you can't stick your hand all the way through it like this. Well, now I have these ones and I'm a doofus, so yeah, dangerous for me. So I put my finger in like this and opened it and went like that. And now it's hurting because I it tried to go all the way open. And it couldn't go all the way open because my finger was in. I can't barely reach it. Ugh, I almost got it. Oh my God. I got it. Ah. I'm going to ignore the pain. Ignore the pain. I'm going to ignore the pain. All right. Yeah, today's not a good day. It's going to be a bad pain day. It's going to be a good day, but it's pain is going to be bad. But other than that, it'll be good. Trying to look at all the good. Okay, so we're gonna do half these blocks. Oh, and that wasn't really half, but that's what we're gonna do. What am I doing? I don't know why. I can't do things. Out. Oh, probably because my knife is so dull. Because my knife is dull. <laughs> yeah, that wouldn't be a reason there, really. So. <sighs> all right. And here he is. Oh, mom's grating some cheese. I'm gonna go visit now. <laughs> hey, sweetie, what you doing? Did I wake you up by the smell of cheese or the noise of cheese? You want a piece of cheese, sweetie? Here, let me get, let me get us a knife here. We'll cut a little piece off, okay? Cut a little piece off for you. 
cheese is no good for dogs. I know you love it. You're a junk food junkie because of me. But cheese not good for dogs. Besides, that's a little thick, don't you think? Don't you think that's a little thick? I know, right? There you go. Last bite. That's it. That's all you're getting. Go away now. Go on. You're not getting no more. He didn't move. He's right there. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Wondering why I'm only giving you those. That? Because we don't need to eat a bunch of cheese. There's going to be cheese in our taco omelet. Silly. Silly guy. Silly Billy. it up. Maybe I didn't cut it right. <laughs> I'm kind of tired. I need to take a break soon. I tell you, that pain is just wearing me down to the nubs. I am worn down to the nub. My breast distance hurts so bad. They are not feeling good today. Here, have another piece. Go on with your bad self now. Go on. Go get it now. See, it fills it up. So half a block for each fills this bowl up. And we will use this for the omelets. Get the cheese out of there. Come on, come out of there. I like to try and get all the cheese out because when you wash it, it makes it better to wash. All right. We are done with that, and I I want to mix it. Let's see if I can do that. Let's see if I can put the lid on and mix it. I got cheese everywhere. I'm so messy all the time. What's up with that? pieces of cheese up off the counter. This is usually what I give to my dog. So he'll get this. And whatever wants to stick to the plate there. Here you go. Just little pieces. He's a junk food junkie like me. But he's 11 now. Lots of opsos don't usually live much past 12 or 13. Even though he acts like a puppy, he's not. But he is, uh, does act like a puppy so much. I wonder if he's not going to live longer because he's so spry. Because his aunt, we, she passed away when she was 11. And when she was 11, she, she was not moving like he does. That's for sure. She was. Now, he's got cataracts. And she got cataracts, but she got cataracts like when she was eight. He didn't want, no, he didn't have it when he was eight. It just came about in the last, um, when the last smoke was here, right before I had my cataract surgery. Same time, he, he's what started going blind with that smoke. The air quality was terrible up here. Okay, so I think we're ready but I'm going to go ahead and take a break. So um, then I'll come back and we'll finish this up. 
I'll be back instantaneously, by the way. <laughs> uh, I'm in rare mode today. I can't help it. Um, I had my friend on the phone and we were talking and we were just cracking up. I don't even remember what we were talking about, but we, we, we got to laughing pretty good. So, anyways, I will be in night back. Hey, dusty, dusty house. I need to hire a housekeeper so I can keep my house clean. Um, yeah, I'll...